Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Adani's Gamer Space. This is going to be uh, a video um, tutorial on the Spire of Stars Leviathan um, Raid Hall. And um, yeah, so uh, this is going to be our first clear as a clan. And uh, yeah, we're just going to talk it through. So we just started the encounter. And we are now waiting for ads to spawn, which we will then uh, proceed to kill. And uh, I will be looking to uh, get uh, finishers because I have a build right now to boost my sword damage. And the only way to do that is to get charged with light. And uh, since I can't pick up orbs, since I have full super, I am using which now I don't, but I'm using uh, the way to get uh, charged with light by uh, finishers. So I'm a, unfortunately I'm about to die here because I was in the process of, of um, healing while uh, and uh, then I got hit with fire, but uh, we should be good to go at this point and yeah. So uh, after the ads are clear, we uh, to the four people that are on plates uh, will go back to their plates assigned. So you'll assign to, and then you'll shoot out an orb. The orb will need to be passed to each player. Um, and as you can see there, and it, it's pretty easy to do that. And as long as somebody's standing on that plate, they'll automatically catch it. After they've touched the orb, they go back to killing ads. And then. Um, the person who touches the orb last throws it at the boss, and the boss is then uh, go takes you to the next phase. The next phase will include these uh, pods, and you'll kill the ad that spawns on the pod, and then uh, all the people who are assigned to plates will go to their plates, and one person will, who is given a buff, you see on the screen, superior retainer. So the superior retainer allows you to go up um, that orange uh, uh, cylinder that you saw just a minute ago on the screen up by the boss. And um, so when he's up by the boss, when he's up in that cylinder, you'll see two symbols. The symbols will tell you, as you can see on the floor, where to dunk the orb that I currently have in my hand. So as you can see, I'm standing on it. Once all three players are standing on it, you can throw the orb at the purple circle that's in the middle, and it will pop that. Once you've popped two of those, it will destroy two ships above the boss. When the boss, is, when the two ships are destroyed, it will, oh, I'm sorry, it will spawn orbs, and use the orbs to destroy the ships. My fault. So now I have the orb. I'm going to go through the white whiskey, I'm going to go up the cylinder, and it's going to take me to the ship. And I'm going to stir the orb, and I'm going to destroy the ship. And my partner there is going to destroy the other one. So once we've destroyed those ships, then it spawns additional orb. So one, it will spawn one additional orb, as you can see on the little diamond on the screen. Um, you'll pick up that orb. And three, uh, that person who picks up the orb, preferably three assigned people, will uh, take that orb to the back behind the boss and just pass it. Because you'll get a uh, debuff called greed. And if you get too much greed, you'll die. So you pass it back and forth. Once you've charged it and started passing it, a second orb will spawn. The, uh, two of the remaining three people will grab that orb and head to behind the boss. That will leave one orb that will spawn for one last person in that time. When that last person gets the orb and charges it in the white whisper, you then look up at the uh, callous uh, robot and his hand will start glowing in just a second. Right there, and you throw the orb in the orb. As long as you get close, it should be good. From there, it's DPS phase. You get your, you get your bucks, whatever you gotta do. You go to the corner, you go out the ground, you go to the corner. Unfortunately, you will have to do this twice. Because you cannot be wrong. So, otherwise, you will easily kill it. So, 
And we now go to do this again. Now, when we do this again, we will get completely new um, people with that superior retainer buff. And in this case, I will not have the superior retainer buff. Somebody will have, will have to go up the uh, the orange cell. So we're going to continue here. Go ads. This is just the ad phase. Um, as you can see, I'm working on getting charged with light with my finishers because that gives me additional sword damage. So, I mean, granted, it, it, you know, we don't really need the damage. So it's just to have it. So we go back to our plate and throw that in the the left so then the person who's on the left plate will then go back to the middle I get out of the way because if I'm in the way he might be he might accidentally attack me because of how auto it is so just make sure that if you have to throw it the other direction that you just get out of the way so you don't uh, have to free catch it because those couple extra seconds make a huge difference so as you can see uh, we're still, you know, we still hover around our plates, we take care of our guy. You, if you're on the middle plate, you help the outside. There's also two roamers um, that, will, that don't that aren't assigned the plate. They just roam and the ads too. So in this case, we'll have another, uh, another guy who has the superior retainer buff go up, up the orange cylinder and call out the symbols that are on top of the ships. And we do it again. So in this case, you have... So we have our orbs now, because somebody's called out, and uh, they did not call out square in this case, but in this case, we still have to stand on it. All of the, um, all of the doors will not open unless all the, uh, all the uh, platforms are standing. So in this case, we're standing on the platforms. You'll notice in the bottom left-hand corner, it will say our arm, the fusion missile arm. Also, then it will say, uh, okay, it looks like it already did say, there's, there's two. Um, and so, in this case, uh, we're going to just play ads again. And again, we're talking, this is the orb thing. So we have two orbs, so they have to be picked up by a superior and charged with the white whiskey that's over by the box. And once it's done, they go up the two, and throw the ball, they, they do again, throw the balls at the uh, ships, and then once they do, it will then spawn another orb down you know, on, the on the floor for, again, for those three players, the three initial players that you assigned to pick up the uh, first orb, will then take that orb and go back to the back and toss it around you to avoid people from getting too much grief. And I'm on the second phase, so there's our second orb. Uh, I'm get it. There we go. And uh, so the rascal there has it. And we're going to go back behind the boss. And there will be one more orb once it's charged. There will be one more orb that spawns. And once it does, then we will go back to the EPS base. It will allow us to finish the boss. And then. four orbs. So you all need to do it ASAP. Pick them up. So that I can't it. And once you hit them with four orbs, there you go. GG, gentlemen. Tower Hooligan's first creator of Spire of Stars. Thank you very much. And due to the fact that the new um, the new triumph, the new moment of triumph, you automatically get the, um, you automatically get the hammock emote. And as you can see, there it is.
Good stuff. Now we're going to pose for the picture, and uh, we will put the picture as the um, thumbnail. So yeah, um, thank you for watching. Uh, please give me any input and uh, let me know what you think. Um, I know that was a fast uh, rundown. We did this um, a, a lot, but damage is not a factor. It's, it's strictly mechanic heavy. Once you knock out all the mechanics, you're, you're, you're set. You're not going to have to worry about damage on the boss. He's super, da he's super easy to, to damage. You can use a sword, especially with the guillotine. It just slays. So, um, you know, damage is easy. So it's just getting the mechanics. And, uh, yeah. So if you like the video, please uh, hit the like button. Uh, if you like the content, please hit the subscribe button so you can see when I have uh, no more videos when I post the new videos. And uh, yeah, uh, if you want to go follow me on Adani's Gamer Space at uh, Facebook.com, that's where I stream. And uh, yeah, thank you all for watching and, and uh, look out for my next video. Thank you so much. This is Adani signing out.